This is your Active Aging Minute, healthy tips for successful aging, brought to you by Active Aging Canada. Today we're talking with John Griffin, an award-winning retired professor, researcher, and author. If you had any troubles in the time up and go, there is a daily dose that would be very helpful for you. Mobility and agility have a lot to do with very quick changes in the position of your feet and your legs. So to practice this, one of the ways, holding on to something for support, and with one leg in front of the other, roll up onto your toes and then back onto your heels. So onto your toes, then back to your heels, to three times, two, three, and now this time, switch legs. Up on your toes, back on your heels, up on your toes, back on your heels, switch legs. I know many of you like to play racket sports, whether it's tennis or pickleball or badminton, whatever it may be. One of the things that can improve your game is mobility and agility. In this next little activity, it's something you can do if you get to the courts and you want to warm up just a little bit, even if you're waiting for a court. And it's a matter of lunging to a forehand, coming back, lunging to a backhand volley, and coming back. You'll find that you're ready to play if you've done the right warm-up and you've got that much more mobility and agility under your belt. Remember, health is our responsibility, but it plays great dividends of quality of life. To make our active aging minutes as fun and as playful as possible. So enjoy your activity, enjoy your quality of life, enjoy your active aging minute.